major conference on policing and community interaction is getting ready to take place here in our city. Yeah, and as WLWT News 5's anchor Curtis Fuller reports tonight, everything from Cincinnati's collaborative agreement to teenage violence is on the agenda. Strategies involving public safety, that's the focus of a three-day conference here in Cincinnati that will look at where we've been, where we are, and where we're headed. It's a regional police accountability and public safety conference. It comes at a time when violence and guns are on everyone's radar, including the United States Attorney for the Southern District of Ohio, Kenneth Parker. You know, when I talk about the issues of violence, it bleeds into other areas with the firearms in the sense of postal robberies. There's no tolerance for that. Uh, individuals may want to say afterwards, I'm sorry. Sorry doesn't count. Um, we will hold you accountable. We're going to look to ensure that individuals uh, in that accountability receive imprisonment. Iris Rowley telling me problem solving and the collaborative agreement are among the other topics that will be front and center. It all started out of the refresh, report back to the community of this is what we've done, this is where we're lacking, what we need to do. Rowley says the discussion will include improving policies for youth police interactions, getting parents, community leaders, and police connected. Fortunately, somehow, Curtis, we've all stayed together uh, around this work. Tonight's session runs until 9 o'clock. It will be held at the Innovation Hub in Avondale on Reading Road. I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5. And by the way, tonight's program begins at 530 at the 1819 Innovation Hub there in Avondale. Workshops and other panel sessions will be held uh, tomorrow and Saturday at New Prospect Church there in Roselawn.